knock, knock. Hey, Dad. Hey, sport. Uh, I think it's time you and me had a little talk. Is it going to be as awkward as last time? Let's go. Thanks for driving, pal. It's going to be a couple weeks before I get my license back. Oh, careful there, kid. It's a tricky clutch. See, sport, when a man loves a woman and a government increases spending or decreases tax rates, uh, that can lead to a deficit, and they need to fill the deficit with something. But you can't always print more money to fix your problems. I want you to remember that. Now, these governments have to borrow from foreign or domestic lenders, and when they borrow that money, the interest rates go up. Come down here for a minute, kiddo. If the interest rates go up, would you want to invest? That's right. So, this government spending is using up financial resources that would otherwise be used by private companies. They call it crowding out. So, this demand for loanable funds from the government moves the demand curve for the loanable funds to the right and up. <laughs> this increase in demand uh, increases the real interest rate, um, which also increases the opportunity cost for borrowing money. And that's... Oh, kiddo, sorry. Man, you're a lot faster than you used to be. Right, goes. Okay, so this in, this in, this increase in opportunity cost lowers the interest that people have in investing. All right, pal. So when you're done with your bath, I want you to show me what you learned with your action figures. They're adult collectibles. Of course they are. Alright, so like, Commander Video needs to fill a deficit, so he borrows from domestic or foreign lenders. And here we have Ezio representing Italy. Now the increase in demand of loanable funds shifts the demand curve, so when Italy gives money to Commander Video, his interest rates rise. Now, Samus was planning on investing, but since it's in her best interest not to at this point, she doesn't. Government borrowing led to Samus being crowded out of investment property. Good day with you. Proud of you. I love you, son. Love you, Dad.